Hey there. Today, I'll be talking about a problem I usually have. It's called cancer. It's called being ignorant or negligent or anything you can find at the source.com. Spilets. Oi, oi. I'm ignorant. Ain't I great? <coughs> but, but if you're ignorant, how do you make good and quality videos? Shh. Let me continue my video. Yes. I can't prove thy points, as Shakespeare once told me. Thy sweat is on thy thigh, must be thy thigh. What? Uh, why are you here? I'm gonna rape ya! Go back to your ditch! I. I. <laughs> Anyways, what I mean by being ignorant is that I will always try to argue about something, but I won't have the knowledge or research to prove myself. Here's an example Hey, I think that being you is the best thing in the world! Do you have any reason to prove that? I I mean, uh, you're you're funny. You're you're, you're great. You're great. It's time to commit the ritual. I even did it once in one of my animations. It was not always used for making fun of those who had done those things that fit with this term, because some animators actually use this term in some of their titles. I don't know what my point is anymore. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Help. HELP ME! So yeah, I motivate a lot. Especially when it comes to friends or just someone who is not seeing the picture. So here's a motivation quote for everyone watching. I believe that everyone can improve if they just try hard enough. Hello Triangle, 2018. That quote was pretty simple to understand. I use motivation more than proving a point because it just means I care more than proving something. I want to help people. People have a hard time understanding things. In arguments, I can't help, but with motivation, I can. Why do you kids bother to argue? It's pointless and a waste of time. You there with the hair. I agree with you, with what you have to say. I can't believe what you are. Are you just fucking my class? What? No, I was just explaining how- It's time to complete the ritual. What? Wait. <sighs> so, here's a personal story that I usually keep to myself. But I might as well get it off my chest. So by now, you guys should know Kutli, or Katie, whichever you want to call her. It. Anyways, there was a time where Katie doesn't believe in God. Well, still does. This was my first time having a friend who was an atheist. So, me, being a Christian and all, had to try and prove a point to her and convince her there is a God. Let's just say, it didn't go so well. And I basically stopped worrying about it. See? Sorry about that, Katie. <laughs> Please don't send me back to that camp. That camp have be Bullet points. It's like writing a book. It's stressful. And you don't have all the details. And you need to do so much just to jot everything down. It's a freaking roller coaster. For anyone trying to prove a point, it won't work. Unless you know what you're talking about. Unlike me. So, don't get too excited on the inside because you might feel you're telling them so because you're really not. But yet, don't feel too down in the dumps if you are. Because there is a chance for everyone to prove a point, and hopefully I can too one day. But for now, I'm stuck here with Shakespeare. And I might die. Well that happened. <coughs> um, so thank you guys again for watching uh, this animation. Uh, sorry, again, it took so long to get out. Uh, actually, this was my other animation was scrapped because I just didn't like it that much. And I thought giving this a try might work out. And surprisingly it did. I, I'm trying to get out a whole wing. <laughs> um, but yeah, just leave me. Leave now. <laughs>